This episode was, you know what? Welcome to my channel. I'm Mr. Dorf Phoenix. This is Batman to Spider Man bringing you guys the latest episode of Arrow. This is the first time you're catching my channel. Please hit that subscribe button because I post videos every week. And I'd love to have you guys a part of the nerdy, geeky family that we have here on YouTube. If this is the first time you're catching my channel. This is going to be a spoiler review. So I'm not going to be like BuzzFeed on Facebook and spoil it for you. So if you haven't seen it, Come back when you have, and if you have seen it, let's jump right out into the newest episode of Arrow, Broken Arrow. Spoiler start right now. Props to Laurel. She pulled some She-Hulk shit. Like, she was like, you have to let my client go, because I said so, and Kay thanks, bye. Oh, but he confessed, uh, no, bitch. Okay, he needs to go, because, what, now you're above the law? And I'm like, damn. I'm glad Laurel's got some balls now, like... Canary balls are dropping as we speak, and it's beautiful. Props to you. Jonies, what have you thought about this? We haven't talked about Laurel in a long time, girl. Comment and let me know what you think about Laurel today. Our lair is exposed again, although this time we didn't have time to clean it out from being the secret lair to a basement. Which I, It was funny that they referenced that, and it was funny that I brought that up because I was like, damn. We didn't have time to clean it out. If you'd have given us like a, a, a day's notice, then we could have cleaned it out. But, damn it, they exposed our lair. Get out of here. Ray and Felicity being secretly related. I was just saying about how I feel like Arrow lost its comedy with Oliver. Because I'm like, Oliver's been so serious lately. I'm like, why can't he like crack a joke like he used to? And then he just watched him and her uh, Felicity talk. And he was just like... I think you and Ray might secretly be related, and then Felicity's face, and then his face, and I was like, ew, Jamie and Cersei, and I was like, finally, with the comedy, like, funny Oliver, where the hell have you been? And so glad to have you back. Um, Felicity always beats the bad guys, in case you haven't noticed, like, when Felicity was captured by Heat Vision Man, I was like, nah, son, she subdued Deathstroke, so... Felicity ain't scared of shit now. She ain't scared of nobody. Like, Felicity can fight everybody. Felicity can go up against Ray should find some way to beat his ass. So, Felicity is our Hulk. Like, you have you have an army, we have a Felicity. She's a bitch with Wi-Fi. Yeah, um, yeah, um... Ray Lover fights the bad guy. That scene was fun because like I hope I hope I hope you play video games again. Hold on, I have to concentrate. And he was like fighting with him. I'm like, yeah, more video game references, more Wreck It Ralph references or something like that. But they could have called like Wreck It Ray trademark. It's mine. If you use it, I want people to to know I did it. But it was just fun to see like Oliver depend on people again because it's honestly like you're not doing this by your damn self. And, yeah, DC takes a, uh, bit from Marvel, and Roy dies, but not really. At first, I was like, mm-hmm, no, you ain't killing my Roy, nope. Not after this whole save Roy shit, you already killed him once, you ain't gonna kill him again. And then, yeah, Roy dies, but not really. That plan was awesome, though. Like, they thought of this shit way in advance, and I'm like, good. Keep more things from Oliver like he does to all of you, but for the greater good. Um, time for a new Titan. I don't think he's coming back with Teen Wolf. Since they like casted a whole bunch of other people after he left, but he could come back. Teen Wolf said an old character would return, so I doubt it's the twin. Oh, the one now, but we're gonna go into that later. Cisco appeared. That I was legit so surprised. I saw the the picture that Mark Guggenheim posted about uh the set. And it looked like a Flash set, so I was like, I know that the people on Arrow aren't going to build a Flash set, so I didn't even, like, think of anybody coming. I just I was like, okay, they built something, you know, maybe this is for, like, a future episode or whatever. It didn't cross my mind until later when I was like, oh, shit, he went to Central City and put him in the prison himself. Like, and him and Cisco bonding is so great. I love their relationship, like... 
But then again, I was like, oh man, like Carlos Valdez posted that he was on it like five minutes afterward. So, because I have him as my star on Twitter, just in case he p-tweet, p I know. So if I didn't see it, I'd be pissed. I'd be like, damn, bro, you ruined it. But I watched it already, so kudos to that. And he was a metahuman before the explosion. I'm like, huh, looks like you've got some powered people in your midst. That's probably what's going to bridge the gap between Season 2 of The Flash. Like, you've got powered people before and after the explosion. Thea versus Rachel Ghoul, girl, you did something. You, you fought your ass off. GG's. I seriously condone you for having the nuts to do what you just did. I wish she'd have grabbed a sword or something, though. And then it could have been like a sword fight. We could have seen what she's been doing, because I, I feel like that's where she shines more versus then, you know, the hand-to-hand. -hand. But she still fought really well, so kudos to you until Rache threw you up against the table and stabbed you to death. So, but then again, this is Thea dies, but not really. See how DC's taking notes from Marvel? And the Lazarus Pit's going to be used. Finally. It's what we've bitched about since you first brought in Ra's al Ghul. Lazarus Pit. Because, you know, we're just going to dunk everybody in that shit. It's going to work on Thea. And we're going to get Sarah's ass in that shit. Because we got to get Sarah in some Lazarus Pit. She's got to come back with a spinoff. And in case you guys didn't notice from the preview for next week... That seriously looked like Sarah's Canary. Because it had, like, the arms exposed and her hair and her, um, chesty LaRue-ness. So, I don't know what's going on. Like, it, 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 it'd be too soon for them to dunk Sarah in there. But we're definitely going to see Thea dunk in there. She's going to be crazy for a little bit, and then she'll be speedy. So, I don't know. But, common question of the day is, what do you think Roy's going to do? Do you think he's going to go to Titans or do my Teen Wolf fans think he's going to go back to Teen Wolf? Comment down below and let me know. And just so that you guys know, I made up a little thing for where Roy's going. Roy's going to be in the T-E-E-N-T-I-T-A-N-S. Teen Titans. Let's go. I did that for you guys because I'm fun and I love you guys. Always remember that through good times and bad times, remember to geek out and enjoy your lives. And I'll catch you guys next week for some Game of Thrones, Gotham, The Flash, Agent of the Shield, and more Arrow. And some Daredevil.